Hello everyone, and welcome back to our historical journey through time. Today we embark on a captivating exploration of an often overlooked gem, nestled in the picturesque Shropshire countryside, Buildwas Abbey. I'm your host, McBrowser, and together, let's uncover the rich tapestry of history woven into the very stones of this magnificent abbey. Before we dive into the specifics of Buildwas Abbey, let's set the stage. The 12th century was a time of great change and religious fervor in medieval England. Monasteries dotted the landscape, serving as centers of spiritual contemplation, scholarship, and community. Buildwas Abbey is no exception, with its origins deeply rooted in the turbulent times of the 12th century. Buildwas Abbey was founded in 1135 by Roger de Clinton, Bishop of Coventry, as a daughter house of the Cistercian Abbey of Savigny in Normandy. The Cistercian Order was known for its commitment to simplicity and austerity, and Buildwas exemplifies these principles in its architecture and lifestyle. As we explore the abbey ruins today, it's important to imagine the bustling activity that once echoed through these hallowed halls. The abbey thrived for centuries, becoming a hub for religious worship, agricultural innovation, and artistic expression. Now, let's delve into the architectural marvels of Buildwas Abbey. The church, with its graceful Gothic arches and towering columns, stands as a testament to the skilled craftsmanship of medieval builders. The cloister, surrounded by the chapter house, dormitory and other essential structures, provided a harmonious space for monastic life. One can't help but be awestruck by the intricate carvings and detailing that adorn the abbey. The skilled masons of Buildwas left behind a legacy etched in stone, telling stories of faith, life, and the passage of time. Like many religious institutions, Buildwas Abbey faced challenges throughout its existence. The dissolution of the monasteries in the 16th century, ordered by King Henry VIII, marked a dark chapter for many religious houses, including Buildwas. The abbey fell into ruin, its once vibrant community dispersed. However, the story doesn't end there. Over the centuries, various attempts at restoration and preservation have allowed us to glimpse the former glory of Buildwas Abbey. Today, the ruins stand as a silent witness to the ebb and flow of history. Beyond its historical significance, Buildwas Abbey has left an indelible mark on the cultural landscape. Artists, writers and historians have drawn inspiration from these ruins, weaving the abbey into the fabric of literature and art.
Visitors who wander through the Abbey grounds today can't help but feel a sense of connection to the past, as if the echoes of centuries gone by still resonate in the quiet corners of these ruins. And so, our journey through time at Buildwas Abbey comes to a close. We've uncovered the layers of history, marveled at the architectural prowess, and reflected on the cultural impact of this hidden gem. Join me next time, as we continue our exploration of the captivating stories that lie within the folds of time. Until then, this is McBrowser signing off. If you've enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe, so that you don't miss out on future videos.